Hello and welcome to this new Cubix tutorial. Actually, uh, four days ago or so I did a few videos and I thought, yeah, that's it. I don't have to do any videos in the next days. But <laughs> that's just what I thought. So you might remember in the camera mapping tutorial I said, yeah, aligning the camera is pretty difficult, it's tricky, you have to try out. But someone told me I'm wrong. There's actually an add-on which does the alignment of the camera for you. So I tried it out and I was impressed how effective it works. So I just wanted to share it with you and um, I have to warn you, this video is pretty straightforward. So if you don't get anything uh, watching it the first time, just rewatch it or write a comment. I'm sure uh, that would help you. So. Yeah, enjoy! So, to download the add-on just go to github.com slash stuffmatic slash blam and then scroll down to where it says download the latest release, click on this then download the latest version, go into Blender hit Ctrl, Alt and U to bring up the user preferences, click on add-ons and then click on install from file, click on your file, activate this checkbox, save user settings so actually the settings are there the next time you open up Blender, then close this window, split this window and uh, go into movie clip editor, open up your image. Now we have to create a new grease pencil layer I actually select the red color because that's the color of the uh, x-axis and then I draw a few lines by holding down Ctrl and D and left click or Command D left click. Just I draw a few parallels and then I select a green color because that's the color of the y-axis here in Blender to keep the overview just that's uh, <laughs> it doesn't depend on the color just uh, to keep the overview and we need to give the add-on something to work with so then you can see the y-axis here is green and the x-axis here also everything right make sure the first layer is the x-axis and the second the y-axis then hit calibrate camera and that's it so your camera is set up. Now I'm skating up, uh, skating down the cube, moving it so uh, to where the anvil is. And now you can see how it actually lines up with the 3D scene, uh, how the 3D scene lines up with the image. Yeah, in this way. And actually, it's pretty cool. Just in two minutes, you have a super perfect setup of your camera, alignment of your camera and the focal length is set and uh, the position, the orientation, everything is just in the right spot so that's just great. Thanks for this tip again and yeah, that's it. So on the left hand side there is the camera mapping tutorial and if you click on this the video will start where the camera alignment is done and on the right hand side there is the trailer to the camera mapping tutorials. And yeah I know this tutorial was pretty straightforward so maybe I'm going to do a more in depth tutorial on the BLAM Blender add-on where I just explain all the functions and where I'm not going to talk so fast and yeah as as always I would be happy to get some feedback from you just what you like about my videos what you don't like maybe even subscribe and uh, yeah thanks for watching bye it's